as you can see by the caption below what i'm going to talk about today and i don't know why this crossed my mind but literally like i think it was like two years ago or two or three years ago everyone was like we're going to get superpowers we're gonna get superpowers we're gonna wake up and have superpowers um it was like mid covid or like when covid first started i don't know y'all know if y'all know but um people are like we're gonna wake up and black people are gonna be flying <laughs> like real shit but let me get to the point let me get to the point we did get superpowers okay but just because y'all don't see us flying around this motherfucker don't mean that we didn't get superpowers okay we did develop superpowers discernment we developed the ability to manifest the light that we want uh, we have the ability to see because if you think about it years ago in your life how long how long did it take you to develop these abilities or the power to overcome anything that's a superpower because some of these things that y'all went through including myself was meant to break us it was meant to lower our vibration down it was meant to cause us to have an identity crisis it was meant to put us low okay and the power of discernment is real it is real to not have discernment you will believe anything that you see anything that you hear there is people out here okay that turn on the news and they listen they see and they take all this information in and they go with it they believe it they're sitting in their root chakra they're believing everything that they see and they hear but us we have discernment we can scroll past something be like eh, all right and just keep keep it pushing it didn't have no effect on us it was just like all right whatever you know that was some bullshit but i'm gonna keep it pushing we can see it but not intake that into our mind that is a power that is a superpower because things that you see and hear every day they get into your subconscious and then you start acting on those things that you've seen and you hear okay but having discernment keep your mind protected now the ability to manifest this is this isn't visualizing something that you want and it appears okay this is raising your vibration to the light that you want you have to match the things you're asking for this is a perception shift okay manifestation is basically being in a mindset of what you want to be and what you want to be in your reality so if you want to be rich famous and successful baby you're gonna have to put in the work and match that frequency of abundance of success you can't just be like Right now in this state, I want all of these things, not put in any work in and think they're going to show up in your reality because they're not. You need to do the shadow work. You need to put in the work and you need to believe that it's going to happen. You need to be at the level that you want to be at perception wise. It's all about perception. Okay, and I'm gonna I'm gonna make another video about timeline jumping, but I'm gonna I'm gonna let you know right now to timeline jump to your highest timeline to meet your highest self which we are all doing it's perception change okay you have to change your perception to your higher self and be that it takes steps it takes lessons it takes time but you can do it i promise you that okay <sighs> i had a lot on my mind today but i had went out had you know lived my life today but this really been on my mind heavy because this keep playing in my mind like man we do have superpowers we really can do a lot of things that other people cannot do okay they can't see i keep saying okay i don't know why i'm doing that disregard that um but yeah we can do a lot of things that regular people cannot do i'm not saying that we're better than anyone else everyone has their own time everybody develops these skills at the time that they're needed and don't force yourself to be a certain way. It will come naturally when it's your time. I didn't have discernment before. I literally didn't. There was shit that I would see. This was years ago, literally. I'm just like, damn, that's fucked up. That's crazy. I can't believe that happened. And even being tied into like celebrity shit and like, like, I don't even know what the fuck happened to Will Smith and Chris Rock, but everyone keep trying to talk to me about it. Like, I don't give a shit. 
I don't. I do not care. It's a distraction. It's all a distraction. To be truly awake is to be aware of self. Don't let nothing outside of yourself take your attention away from yourself. Don't. To be aware is to be self-aware. You can get on here and talk about how, you know, shit is going crazy and COVID and the news and reptilians and all types of shit like that. You can you can get on here and say that all, all the time. That don't mean you're woke. It just means you're watching somebody else say all this shit and you repeating it. If you can't give no real knowledge about self and being self-aware and meditating and being aligned with your true self and your higher self, then it's not being self-aware. You can be aware of the outside world as much as you fucking want, but it's the inside that matter. And once you develop that skill of self-love, self-awareness, those are superpowers, baby. That's a superpower. And this is now. Imagine not even one year from now, six months okay it's gonna come a time where you're gonna look back and and be like damn i done i done ascended even when i thought i was you feel me woke as fuck now you done had another awakening (laughs) this shit has levels to it just chill in the present moment keep being self-aware give gratitude don't forget give that gratitude because everything that is right now in your present moment is everything that you need once you realize that once you realize that you will probably switch perceptions it happens to me all the time when i finally like i go through lessons it takes me time to catch up because i still be in the past thinking about what just happened i'm i'm everywhere until you have all of you in this present moment you have complete awareness of what's going on right now you give it gratitude the next lesson won't come perception shift it's all about perception your insides match your outside if you are chaotic it's because inside needs to be maintained and and cleaned up shadow work if you're hitting lows and you're not you're not sitting with yourself and trying to figure out why or if you getting triggered and you not trying to sit with yourself and figure out why you're you're lacking okay you're slacking if somebody says something to you and it pisses you off to the point where you change your frequency because look there ain't nothing wrong with defending yourself and that's where a lot of people get wrong okay it's not all love and light it's not we're in a spiritual war I'm not going to let nobody downplay me no more. I'm going to speak up when I feel like it's right. I'm not going to let nobody tell me any different. But it's not changing my frequency. Okay? It's not. I'm going to speak my truth and be in my highest frequency. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> I could be in my highest frequency and still tell you exactly how it is. You're not changing nothing, but I'm going to speak my truth. I'm gonna, my throat chakra going to be open. You're not going to like it because you're not affecting my frequency okay it's a squirrel i've been seeing a lot of spiders a lot of squirrels and birds i've been seeing a lot of synchronicities because five 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 change is coming it's almost summertime i keep showing y'all the sun it's almost summertime and the summer brings abundance the winter was time to reflect time to i just got my hair and started their loud house car but anyway i'm gonna let y'all go though i'm gonna come back with another video i love y'all